We're going to have a look in this video at how to use the painter tool just here. So if I have a select onto this, you've got it's called the ground brush and we can paint the ground just by pressing the left mouse button. That's the very simple thing and we can use the right mouse button to delete the land. Now of course there's other things you might want to do with this. So there's two options here. The first one is this little option up on the left hand side which allows you to change the type of ground and then this option which allows you to change the brush. You can also change the brush size as it says up here by using the left and right keys. So I'm going to make a giant square of green. So you can see I've got a perfectly large square. I'm going to shrink the brush size down and what I can then do is I can choose different terrain. So for example I might want this lovely star pattern here and as you can see it just puts it in and we can paint it around and of course if we create new land to the side it becomes exactly the same sort of terrain. Deleting, adding, exactly the same as before. If we want to go back to the grass we've got to then go back to the grass here. You'll notice that it puts the most often used ones at the front so if you've selected a kind of terrain before it should be there. Now you've also got this particular tool here which allows you to change the brush shape. I'm just going to go to a different type of terrain so you can see the effect and I'm going to make the brush much smaller. So at the moment we've been using the square brush as you can see. The circular brush is as you'd expect creating circles and as the circle gets bigger obviously the more circular it seems. There's also this brush here which is a uh, way to do an extended piece so you click and drag and it's only when you actually drop it that it then produces the thing that you want so you can see you can make sort of straight paths using this method the last one so the circular the circular one is just the same but it's got rounded ends. The last one I want to look at is this magic brush here. And what that does is it changes one particular colour to another particular colour. So if I choose, for example, a different colour again, so we'll go for this firm black here, you can see that it's flashing the entirety of that colour. So if I click on it, it just converts the absolute entirety of that space to one colour. This obviously helps when you're trying to lay, change large parts of a level. So if you want to change the entirety of this to another colour, we just select our new colour and we say, you know what, there we are in the new colour. So that is the ground brush tool. Of course, in terms of uh, right clicking, that works as well. So you can just delete an entire segment just like that.